In this video, I will show you how to run a report for a specific mailing list so that labels for that group can be printed in the Microsoft Word application. Now the first thing you'll want to do is go to the Reports tab when you're logged into Salesforce and then you'll see this page. And then you can just click the New Report button. And then you'll want to make sure that you select Mail Groups right here and then select Mail Groups with Contacts and then scroll down and click the create button to start your report as you can see nothing shows up the first time but now you need to make some filters so that you can see some results here so for the show click all mail groups and then click the add button next to the filters field for the first drop down filter select account name and that's just right here and then make sure the middle drop down says equals and that should already be selected that way and then for the third field you will enter in the name of your county and for example we'll use Adams County it needs to be written as the name of the county followed by the word county just like that and then you can click the OK button and you want to make sure that you're very precise with the spelling and include the word county or else you will not get results. So if you don't see results after you click OK, you might want to go back and check how you um, that you have account name that says equals and that you did this part right. So after that, we need to add another filter by clicking the Add button again next to the Filter field. And this time, um, we'll make sure Mail Group Name is selected. You'll see it's already selected. And then the middle drop-down needs to be equals still. And then for the third box, we'll enter in the Mail Group from the list that we would like to um, print labels for. So in this example I'm going to use Dairy Committee. And then I'll click the OK button. And as you can see um, in the preview here I have the results for all the members in the Dairy Committee mail group. Now after that I can drag any fields from the field column on the left of the page into the report. And for example, for the mailing list, there are definitely some fields that we would need, and and those would include mailing street, mailing city, mailing state or province, and then of course mailing zip or postal code and then we have the information that we need for our labels then we can go and click run report and then from there you can first save your report so that you can always have that mailing list report to always just click on especially if it is a report that you run very often and if there's any changes changes to it made then you can always just click on the running report and those changes will automatically appear in the report now to um, export your report you just click on the printable view button and then an Excel file will be made that you can save to your computer and then after that you can use that report to print your labels after opening Microsoft Word and if you need help with how to print labels in Word using a mail merge you can follow the steps in this link provided. 